beyond. Yeah, probably by about 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock this morning, uh, the Blue Ridge area should start to see some improvement. I did see a video of that last night. Those chasers were so excited. Uh, if you can, check it out. There's some profanity on it, but check it out. It's uh, some good entertainment. Uh, right now, about a one mile visibility across Murphy, across Cherokee County, and across eastern Monroe County. Uh, most of us, Chattanooga, no issues to tell you about for, uh, for your morning commute. Rapid refresh model is keeping us mostly dry here this morning and really most of the afternoon. By 2 p.m., things start, start to kind of get a little bit more muggy, a little bit more soupy. Uh, these are kind of good old fashioned showers and thunderstorms that we see on a typical July day. Uh, you're like, yeah, 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 this is July weather. 2.30 this afternoon, even a few showers possible across the scenic city, across Chattanooga. Nothing organized, but things could get a little bit more organized tomorrow. If you do plan on headed to the game tonight, 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock, there might be a few showers out there north of the city. This is 8 p.m. So most of the night tonight should be quiet, but we will keep an eye on those showers. Remember yesterday we were only under a 20% chance for rain and we had that downpour across Chattanooga. So some of these, because they're slow movers, they could produce a decent amount of rainfall. Even though Vipercast is going pretty meager, showing tonight at 11 o'clock, most of us rain free, picking up 200 seven inch of rainfall for Chattanooga. If we do get under one of those showers, it's possible we'll get about a quarter of an inch of rain. So tonight, the lookouts take on the Smokies at 715. I'm putting us at a 20% chance at this time. 89 at 7 o'clock. It's going to be a warm evening for the lookouts game. It's also going to be pretty humid, too. Uh, so stay hydrated if you're headed to the game. We are going to stay in the 80s through the entire game. So it's going to slow to cool tonight. We're looking at warm nights here. Hopefully you enjoyed that little mini reprieve last week. 81 still, though, by final out. A mild night tonight. The rain chance over the next six days, then it does increase tomorrow and Wednesday. That's our best storm chance here over the next six days. Then by Thursday and Friday, it's pretty hit and miss. The Wednesday's rain chance is because a front is likely going to be stalling. So we will have to keep an eye on things on going on Wednesday. So do keep that in mind if you have outdoor plans uh, the middle of the week. Today, though, we are going to hit 92 in the city. It's going to be a hot day in the Tennessee Valley. Here's the set next seven days then. As the rain chance upticks, we're looking at Friday, Thursday, Friday, the rain chance lowering, but there is still that rain chance. Saturday and Sunday, low 90s at this point. I am putting the forecast currently for Chattooga and Grundy counties as they head back to school Thursday morning. In the scenic city, 66, that means the outline areas are going to be a little bit cooler. So some areas actually might need like another layer on Thursday morning for the guys waiting for the bus stop.